What's going on everybody? It's Dan the Realtor, your local Montgomery County real estate agent, back again with another video. Today, we're gonna to be looking at three properties in Montgomery County under $500,000. Let's get into it. Hey, new beginnings on the cusp. Not too old to adjust. Old dog, new tricks. Remember, I was just a pup. Son, dirty in my cup. Clean soul, good karma is a must. Still my shooter in the cut. I was stuck inside. So here we are at our first property. First, let me just say, Thank you so much for all of your likes and subscribes and comments on our on my YouTube channel. Um, and we've been building it pretty strong here. Just trying to show you guys what Montgomery County actually has to offer. Um, and a lot of people, one of my clients is like, yo, Don, I really appreciate you. I like all the properties you show on your on your YouTube, but I can't afford it. All you show all these multi-million dollar. I said, all right, don't worry about it, I got you. Today, I'm gonna to be showing you houses in Montgomery County that are under $500,000. You think it can't be done. You think it can't be done. But I'm trying to tell you, MoCo got the spots, man. I'm your MoCo real estate agent. Y'all at your boy. This is what we got today. Today, we got a house, a row house. This house right here, right there. <laughs> $380,000. This is a three bedroom, two and a half bathroom house with 1,200 square feet of living space. Now. This house in this neighborhood is something you may want to consider if you're looking for a nice entry level home, you're moving uh, from an apartment and you want to just get into a piece of property. This is a really nice option for you. Uh, the neighborhood is super quiet. We're here in what we call Montgomery Village. There's lots of uh, amenities uh, in this area. We just passed the pool. We're closer to, we're close to shops and amenities. So let's see what $380,000 gets you here in Montgomery County. So this is a $380,000 house here in Montgomery County. Super cute. As soon as you walk in, you're greeted with your kitchen on your left, the stairs on your right. Let's check it, take a look at the kitchen first. Nice galley kitchen. You know, this $380,000, like I always tell all my clients, look, just get in the game. It's not gonna be your first, it's not gonna be your forever house. It's your first house. And this is a really great, in my opinion, it's a nice starter home because you could easily turn this into a rental. You got an electronic stove. You got, you know, just basic granite counter, uh, basic for mica countertops here. Nothing super fancy. These are great, this would make a great rental and a great starter home. So even if you're just looking to invest in general and you think, hey, this might be a good investment property, it could be. Got an updated refrigerator in there. And then here we walk into what looks like the living room. And I ain't mad at this house. I ain't mad at it. From Montgomery County, if you're looking to move into MoCo, this could be the one. This could be something, you know, something you might want to consider. Definitely has, it's got laminate floors uh, throughout. All right, let's take a look upstairs. Oh, got our first bathroom here. This is good for guests. They wanna, you know, if they wanna use the bathroom and you don't want them all up in your, all up in your spiz ace. So let's check a look upstairs. This is a nice updated bathroom. <clears throat> this is a full bathroom on your main level. You got two. Full bash, you got your friendly real estate agent right there. Bedroom number one. And 
it's got a good amount of space. You know, this is definitely, looks like you can make a good kid's room or an office if you want it. Second bedroom here. This looks like us. it could also make a second kid's room or an office. It's got built-in closets here for you. And this is what $380,000 gets you. Again, you gotta get in, you gotta be in the play. You gotta play to win, <laughs> right? Like the lottery. All right, let's take a look at the master bedroom. Very nice space. You could definitely fit a queen size bed in here. Master bathroom. Let's take a look downstairs. Ooh, got an unfinished basement down here. Not really much to see, but this definitely has some room for you to add your own finishing touches to it. And this is very nice, actually. You got your washer and dryer. And you could add your own space down here. It's got some storage space. For 380000 in Montgomery County, I think this is a really good option for you to consider. Full basement, HVAC, can't hate on it. Cannot hate on this one. Let's take a look at the backyard. Boom. This is very nice. Built-in patio here. So let's talk numbers. One dope thing about the house is you get to get into the market. This is what we call an entry-level house. It's not gonna be for your forever house, but it's good to get into the market and build equity because long story short, real estate is only getting more expensive. So with a modest 5% down payment, not even talk about FHA, a modest 5% down payment, conventional loan, that's gonna run you about $19,000 for your down payment. P&I is gonna run you around $2,371. Your taxes are gonna end up somewhere around $205 per month. For this property at $380,000, your monthly payment end up being somewhere around $3,125 per month. That's at a 6.8% interest rate, which is where around where we are today. Again, this is an estimate. Depending on your credit, depending on your DTI, that number could flex a little bit. That number includes P&I, which is $2,371 per month. Taxes of $205 per month. Insurance ends up being around $215 per month. PMI, which will fall off after you reach 80-20 loan to value of $195 per month. And you got an HOA fee of $138 per month. All in, you'll be coming to the table with $38,000. $19,000 for your down payment, which ends up being about 5% of the purchase price with a conventional loan. And your fixed closing costs end up being somewhere around $14,000. And that $14,000 includes your title fees, your loan policy, title insurance, your escrow fee, admin fees, wire funding fee, lender's title policy, flood certification, attorney's fees, tax service fees, some lender origination fees. There's a bunch of fees. Read the paperwork. <laughs> but overall, you're gonna come to the table with about $38,000 
to buy this $380,000 property in Montgomery County. So there you have it, $380,000 in Montgomery County. Let's head down the street and we're gonna take a look at another property that you can get under $500,000. Stick with me, I'll see you at the next house. All right, all right, all right. We're here now in Gaithersburg at our second house in Montgomery County, under $500,000. We're in the beautiful neighborhood of Watkins Mill. This house has three bedrooms and three full bathrooms and listed at $415,000. I told y'all, I was going, I told you I was going to get you under $500,000 and this is what we got. Let's take a look at it. Okay, so immediately, you'll notice how quiet the neighborhood is again. Now, don't get me wrong, I do be here in the middle of the day. So what I always advise is that you walk your neighborhoods at night, but you ain't gonna have no problems out here. We ain't walking no, we ain't MoCo. MoCo, we treat our neighbors nice out here. This is a three bedroom, three bathroom house. Let's take a look inside. Immediately, I love the curb appeal. Could use a little bit of uh, work on there on their shrubbery. I ain't gonna hold you. Let's take a look inside. All right. So automatically you can see, this one is basically the same floor plan as the one we just came out of, but it's flipped a little bit and it's got some upgrades, different level of, uh, what you call laminate vinyl plate hardwood floors. It's got a little bit more uh, natural light also. But this one's got a lot of room for entertainment. You got a cool wall right there. You can throw a TV up, watch some football games. This is your little dinette area here, a little kitchenette. And your kitchen. Now this kitchen, I like. <laughs> I like this kitchen. You got your granite countertops here. You hear that? Yeah, it's granite. Stainless steel appliances. Electric oven. Electric oven for global. All right. Now you know I can sing, did you? Anyway, that's another video for another day. So we've got three beds, three full baths, and 1,500 square feet. Let's take a look at this little pantry we got here. That's pretty cool, my wife would love that. Oh, I got a pantry. Shit, yeah, baby, got a pantry, yo. All right. Now let's take a look upstairs first. Did I miss the bathroom? No, I didn't miss the bathroom. So you'll notice there's no bathroom on this level. So the one we just came from had a bathroom on the main level. This one does not. Got your pantry. It's not like the toilet might need to be fixed. Let's look at the first bathroom here. Decent, nice floors. Nothing to write home about, but it's again, we're looking at houses under 500,000. I'm not, I'm gonna save the master bedroom for last. Let's take a look at the two main, two smaller rooms here first. This is gonna be your main one here. You can turn this into an office if you wanted to. Or room for the kids. decent size you know again this is just going to be starter home or investment property you want to get in the game and then what you do is you up you, you you take this property and you trade up later once you've built up you know a good amount of equity did I show the second bedroom yet here's the second one this one's pretty small too this one's way smaller than this one's 
smaller than where we just came from, the second bedroom. The bedroom's a little bit smaller in this one, but still a good size for a starter. For a starter home. She can fit an office or a kid's bedroom in here. And then walks right across to the master bedroom. And this one's got a good amount of space. I think you could fit a queen bed in here easy. Pretty easily fit a queen bedroom in here. And then you've got your second full bathroom here. You'll notice then again, the uh, laminated vinyl plank. And the, the bathroom's kind of basic. Nothing to write home about. But we're looking at under 500,000. Let's take a look downstairs. This is your laundry room, your washer and dryer. Got some nice storage back here. Pretty decent. Eight spot. Then you've got your full bathroom down here. So it looks like they built this, but it's pretty good. You know, it gets the job done. And then you've got your full basement here. Pretty spacious, pretty spacious. So this is what $415,000 gets you in Montgomery County. Let's talk some numbers. Take a look outside first. <laughs> see. Yeah, there we go. It's your backyard here. Again, they could definitely use some landscaping. Uh, wouldn't hurt, but that's something that you can do. But it's got a nice size yard to it. And it backs up to the woods. Here's the whole house back here. That's nice. You got a little shed here. You could add a, you know, for storage or whatever you want to make, you know, she said, whatever. All right, let's talk numbers. Get into a house like this in Montgomery County for $415,000. Assuming you're going to put 5% down with a conventional loan at a 6.8% interest rate. Again, this is just an estimate. It's not 100%. So definitely check with your loan officer first. Everything's gonna differ based on your credit and based on your DTI. So your monthly payment on this type of property is gonna end up being somewhere around $3,363. Now your monthly payment is gonna include your P&I, which ends up being around $2,500. Taxes end up being about $185 per month. Your insurance is gonna end up being somewhere around $235 a month. Your PMI is gonna end up being around $213 per month until you get to 8020 LTV and your PMI falls off. And your HOA ends up being around $138. Now, the amount that you're gonna to have to come to closing with is gonna be around $41,000. Assuming we don't get the seller to contribute to your closing costs, that's gonna include your down payment of $20,750, your prepaids of $5,150, and your fixed closing costs of $15,493. So this one right here is $415,000. Let's go take a look at the next one and see what else Montgomery County has to offer. I'll see you at the next house. Yeah. I so. It's conscious. Whoa. Doing 90 on the jet skis. Yeah, we live up. Tell these haters, come and get me. Come and get me. Little mama, you look sexy. And she bad. I wanna f she gon' let me. See. I ain't they don't test me. All right, we are here at our third property. We circled back around and came back to Montgomery Village. We're going to be taking a look at this house for $424,900. We're going to be taking a look at this house for $424,900. How you doing? You want to be in my video? You want to be in my video? What kind of video? 
It's a video I'm gonna blast it all over YouTube. It's a, a property video. I'm I'm a real estate agent. I'm a real estate agent. Uh huh. <laughs> Uh, there's, there, it's on the market for four twenty four. Four hundred and twenty four thousand dollars. Oh, they are selling it. Now. Yeah. Home one bed and twenty four. Yep. <laughs> I thought they were friends. They were friends. Break and let it change. Mm hmm. Are you from Africa? Not directly. I came here by force. <laughs> My parents, yes, ma'am. From from here, we all from here. We got here a long time before you. Yeah, we all the same, no. <laughs> we all the same. It's good to meet you. 424, yes, ma'am. Mm-hmm. So we are here in Montgomery. <clears throat> so we are here in Montgomery Village, and we're going to be taking a look at this property for four hundred for four hundred and twenty-four. And we're going to be looking at this property for four hundred. Hey, let's wait for her to finish. Okay, we are here at the next property here in Montgomery Village. We circle back around. I told y'all I was going to find some houses less than five hundred thousand dollars. This house is four hundred and twenty-four thousand nine hundred dollars. It's got three beds, two and a half baths and 1,400 square feet of space. Let's take a look inside. So this is your neighborhood here. Pretty quiet, pretty quiet. And this is gonna be your row house. We got a lot of levels. Let's take a look inside. So immediately as you walk in, you'll notice the grand foyer. Got a lot of stairs. If you're cool with a lot of stairs, this is gonna be a really great property for you. And this property for $424,000, I think is a great deal. I mean, you've got a massive amount of space, you've got a fireplace, plenty of room for entertaining. Your dining room, you got real hardwood floors. A lot of mirrors in here. Let's take a look at the kitchen. You got granite countertops, stainless steel appliances. Now you do got a black refrigerator, but you can always swap that out if you wanted to. And this property even comes with a little bit of a deck. This is really cool. Got room to sit outside. And look, it walks all the way around. Got a full walk around deck. Where are you gonna find this at for Mo at MoCo for $424,000? Nerryware, I tell you. Nerryware. Okay, let's keep going. All right, so on your main level, you have a bathroom, you have a half bath. This way people can take a look at the bathroom, don't gotta be all up in your business. I'm really impressed with this house. It's just beautiful. Carpet's in really good shape. Let's head upstairs. Now, if stairs don't scare you, this house is, a good, is gonna be a good house for you. If you're not big on stairs, you got older family members, things like that, Probably ain't gonna be a good house for you. So immediately, get your full bathroom here. 
Nice. Laminate floors. That's an upgraded floor though. You've got your first bedroom here. A lot of room inside. <clears throat> Good size for a kid or an office. <laughs> I'm always pushing kids because I want everybody to have kids. Kids are beautiful. If y'all want kids, you don't have to have them. But I love my son. He's cool. He's a good addition to my life, I'll tell you that. I used to be a savage. <laughs> now I'm domesticated. Showing y'all these beautiful houses in Montgomery County. Take a look at this master bedroom in here. <clears throat> Again, mirror. Your favorite neighborhood realtor. You can fit a king up in this bad boy. I believe you could. Carpet's in decent shape. But for $424,000 and living in one of the premier counties in Maryland, is your walk-in closet. Now you definitely wanna hop, you know, head to Ikea or Crate and Barrel, right? Hop in Ikea or Crate and Barrel or something, boss that out. And then here's your bathroom, your master bathroom. Very nice. I think they did a good job on this property. They did a good job. Can you see yourself living here? All right. Let's talk about the number. Okay, so let's talk a little bit about the numbers for this particular property. If you were to buy this property for $424,000 using a conventional loan with an average of 5% down, here's what those numbers are gonna look like. For a $420,900 house at a 6.875% interest rate on average with 5% down, your monthly payment is gonna be around $3,472. And that payment includes your p and which stands for principal and interest. That's gonna be around $2,651 per month going towards your principal and your interest. In your monthly payment is gonna be included your taxes, which is gonna end up around $223 per month. Insurance is gonna end up around $240 per month. Your PMI, which is your private mortgage insurance, is gonna end up being around $218 a month. And that falls off again once you get the 80-20 LTV. And your HOA is $138, which seems to be a magic number here in Montgomery County. Now, the HOA does cover the outdoor tennis court, the community pool, snow and trash removal and yard maintenance. Now, assuming a 5% down payment on a conventional loan, your total cash to close or the amount that you're gonna to need to bring at settlement is gonna be around $42,000. The down payment portion of that will be around $21,245. Your prepays are gonna be around $5,404 and your fixed closing costs are gonna be around $16,177 for a total of $42,827, assuming we don't get a 3% closing cost credit from the seller. So what'd you think? Could you see yourself living in any of these houses? I showed you three houses in Montgomery County for under $500,000. If you're interested in any of these properties or you're looking to move into the Montgomery County area, click the link below and schedule a Zoom call with me and let's talk about how we can get that started for you. Or you can give me a call on my number at 301-806-3179. Make sure to like, subscribe, and share, and hit that notification button so that you're the first to know when I drop new content. I'm Dan the Realtor. I'll see you next time.